time I'm gonna have to say good afternoon. It is day 27 on our, on our Camino and we are walking from Leon to Manzarif. And it should take about 13 miles to do this, but um, the bad news is we really fucked around this morning. Uh, we didn't leave the hotel till 9.30 and we did some banking and we took some pictures and when we went over to the Paramore and uh, Hotel and um, uh, San Marco Square, probably spent another 30 minutes there. So, um, it literally took us three hours to do five miles. So we still have eight miles to go and it is one o'clock in the afternoon. So, a long day of our own making. Um, and Leon was amazing. Um, the cathedral there just really choked me up. Um, it just, and I think it, and I think it happened to many people, um, just walking in there, uh, you know, I didn't even feel it coming and tears were streaming out of both eyes the whole time I was in there. It was, I was really, I don't know, a special sacred space. Um, and I know my photographs when I put them up will not do it justice, uh, but it was, it was a memorable experience. So were the tapas and the wine. Oh, Spain has got some good food and um, I have really taken to octopus. Uh, and I don't know, uh, I don't know what the name of this dish is, but they bring you an entire octopus leg, <laughs> which has been, um, uh, you know, it's got some smoky flavor to it. Um, and it is one of the most delicious things I've ever had. Oh, I'm gonna have to figure out how to make it myself or find it somewhere in Salt Lake when I come home. That's really something. I will talk to you later. I don't know if you've noticed, but the terrain changes very quickly on the Camino. Um, we were in the Meseta right all the way into Leon, and then it just abruptly stops. Um, we're really not even that far out of the city and the highway system and all the noise and everything. Um, but if I stop, there's nothing but wind and bird song, right? It's very still and it's not crowded either, but I think that's mostly because we were so late getting out today. Um, we've got about two more hours to walk, maybe two and a half. Um, and I expect that it's going to be this country road all the way in to our rest tonight, which is kind of nice. I'm enjoying the stillness a lot. Um, you know, one of the controversies about uh, planning the Camino is what time of year to go. Um, we, we toyed with, oh, maybe springtime, um, certainly not summer. Uh, in fact, a woman died on the Meseta this summer. Um, in, in July, I believe it was, uh, you know, the word, the word on the trail was uh, dehydration. Um, but they had severe heat this year. Um, and she, she died. Her Camino just ended in the Meseta. Everything ended in the Meseta. We, we pass um, homage to uh, dead pilgrims every day. I saw one today, a woman who, who is who died in uh, 2019 on a sidewalk. Um, who knows why, but uh, she was exactly my age. And I thought, wow, that's, that's kind of wild. Um, anyway, uh, so when to come? I'm gonna say September uh, is the bomb. Um, you know, we started our Camino end of August. We're well into September. We're almost to the end of September right now. And the days are peaking at 70 to 74 degrees. And uh, the nights are chilly now. When I was in Leon, um, my light fleece was not enough. I put on long underwear and a light fleece and that still wasn't enough. So somewhere along the way, I'm gonna have to buy a puffy jacket. Um, so I am gonna suggest that if you go into the fall on Camino, uh, bring something small and down that will fit in your backpack and not take up a bunch of space or weight because um, you might really enjoy having it um, as fall progresses. Talk to you later. It's quite 
possible. <laughs> Who's that big dog? <laughs> it's quite possible that our Monday commute is just about to be interrupted uh, by some with some cross traffic. Here we go. Some hard working dogs. Pretty organized operation. Buenos dias. Buenos dias. Buenos dias. Muchas gracias. And there they go. Let's see if we can catch some of this. Oh, we might be in the middle of it actually. Oh, there they come. Yeah. Bunch of them. I love the sound of bells. You know you're in Europe when you hear the sound of bells. <laughs> I'm back at you, buddy. <laughs> There they come. So much fun. me? Well, I appreciate it. Buen Camino.